We've got ourselves a convoy. The Take Our Border Back Summit is looking especially embarrassing when compared to their last attempt. Maybe convoys are finally dying out. This time, they tried to expand to include Canada and Mexico, but there seems to be basically no interest on social media. The Twitter accounts, for example, simply aren't getting much engagement at all, and the Give, Send, Go is under $900 at the time of this recording. And you might be wondering, if they're a summit, are they still a convoy? Yes, yes they are. In fact, they make sure to bold the word convoy in their plans, just like they bold the word prayer in their flyer for the upcoming Texas event. But just because they're embarrassingly not growing and getting attention, doesn't mean they aren't putting out big laughs. So let's take a look at a raffle. Now they have a raffle right now for an AR-15. That is not the one I want to talk about. I want to talk about this raffle here. Fight, 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 donate and support. Take our border back summit. Enter your name in the message box along with Bible and sword raffle. So a Bible and sword raffle. Put on the full armor of God so that you can take the stand against the devil's scheme. It comes with the Founder's Bible and a 41-inch sword. And if if you're like me, you might recognize the sword. But I thought, no. No, there's no way they're going to do that. So I decided to check. And I went on Amazon. And you'll notice some similarities here. And this is a 41-inch uh, medieval foam witcher's hunting long sword for cosplay LARP costume Halloween. Now, the one they're, they're doing might be, um, might be real. Might be a real sword because it's a replica from a video game. The Witcher. And you might notice in the lower right there, the medallion. Uh, why is that there? Uh, that's because this is from an AliExpress version of the sword. Guess what? Uh, The Witcher 3 isn't, um... Is it Christian? <laughs> oh, glorious, glorious. Um, now, the question is, did they just search generic sword? And if so, did they just buy a generic sword and not know what it was related to? Because that's extra funny. Or did they, like, outsource this to, like, one of their kids who doesn't support them and is just messing with them? Because I don't know how else you get his sword. Hilarious. Hilarious. Just, I, I was, I was, I decided to check them out, see if there's any updates, and there was nothing to cover. Nothing worth covering, really. They weren't growing, they weren't doing anything, it wasn't interesting, it was the same people you expect saying the same things. And then they do this. 